And Chief Meteorologist Chris Franklin joining me now. Chris, despite the predictions of a really right. active hurricane season, we haven't really seen any storms. No, well, we haven't seen as many as we thought we would by this point mm. in the season. And again, we still have a lot more of the season to go, but it is unusual for us to be this quiet nearing the peak of the season. And some of the reasons why we think we've had such a slow season thus far are a few. The African monsoon is farther north. This is that feature across Africa where we get those numerous waves. That has shifted a bit. We've also seen an abundance of dry air. We talk about that dry air uh, usually with one storm, but this has really uh, taken over much of the Atlantic Basin, as well as the atmosphere over the tropical Atlantic is very stable, meaning storms just cannot develop. Now, again, we still have a lot more of the season to go. What we're looking forward to is perhaps the African monsoon shifting south. We'll see. Also a little closer to home, the Central American gyre. It becomes active in the start of the season and becomes more active late in the season. So we could see possibly more of those homegrown type storms. Also, we are in a La Nina. La Ninas tend to be a bit more active on the back side, the latter half of the season. And keep in mind that 65% of all tropical activity happens after September 3rd. Something to note though that was interesting, when Colorado State issued their above normal forecast in their discussion they call what they refer to what are called analog years uh, past seasons that are similar to this season and while you see we had the active 2020 season as one of our analogs we also had several seasons that were right at or even below average so even in the early discussions of the seasonal forecast Colorado State mentioned it is possible that we see an average or even below average season so that was always a possibility and we may be kind of moving along that path. But with that said, it only takes one. And don't let that complacency set in just because the first half of the season has been quiet really doesn't say anything about the second half. But thankfully, we're not dealing with anything in the tropics.